Uh, but then there's all sorts of other things like there's hot baths, something that you like e eating, enjoying eating, your favorite restaurant. These things, I think, if these things become in front of your mind before the addiction, that you know that this is a coping mechanism. Because what will happen is the first thing that will come into your mind is the drug, drug, alcohol. This is what's going to come into mind. The minute you wake up, first thing that's going to come into your mind, drug, alcohol. Why? It's for your survival, making you feel better, making you feel relaxed, making you feel forget about the past. So slowly, slowly, if you keep doing these things, they will naturally turn into the first thing that will come into your mind. Drugs will be way back, way back into your mind, which is right now for me. Um, you know, I don't think I've ever been a long time now where I've thought about, okay, you know what, I need a drug to use or make me feel better. Yeah, and most importantly, I think be kind to yourself. Like. Rome wasn't built in a day and it's not easy to figure a lot of stuff, a lot of things about yourself, uh, what you like doing, what you enjoy doing, a lot of techniques that I've spoke about today. But try one, at least try one. And if you can do one a week, that'd be great. And one thing that we all need to understand when it comes to this addiction thing is that these feelings of the past, the future, whatever it is, they don't last for long. You know what I mean? And you need to understand that you will get through it. Believe in yourself that you will get through it. Once it's over, it will be all be over. But find other coping skills, find other ways to do it. Don't just sit there and think it's just the addiction of handle that. That's it. Don't work like that. Believe in yourself. You will get through it. And these feelings, they won't last for long.